people in all the people in uh, Minneapolis, man. There's been a venue change. People wax.com.com for that. Wax reporting to you live. About to embark on the Wax and Herbal Tea low budget mystery tour. We got a fucking U-Haul trailer on the back of the center. Ready to fucking rock. Matt, Matt's gonna be joining with us Damn. on the tour. Right. We're gonna try to document this tour. So uh, Matt's gonna be a part of the reality show uh, cast, you might say. Hey Matt, what are some of your likes and dislikes? I only have dislikes. Uh. There's one and it's you. You got any pet peeves or anything like that? Hey, so Matt, is there anything that really gets under your skin? So what type of things do people do displease you? Anything <laughs> that's really fucking bugging you at this point? You don't, don't know Matt, he's a pretty relaxed dude, man. Not much shit really pisses him off. Fuck! Me and Matt just pulled up to uh, the Ruby Room here in Phoenix. <laughs> we got Jake with us. Jake is originally from St. Louis. And uh, how did you how did you hear about Wax, Jake? I was looking at Prince EA online, my dude from high school. This motherfucker's from St. Louis, and he went to high school with Prince E. Over at Metro. And he, he found Prince E on YouTube, and then found Wax with Prince E. So shout out to Prince E on this shit. Yeah. Shout out to Prince E, man. <laughs> Just got back from the archaeological dig, man. <laughs> Prince E is a fucking shit, man. Yeah, Ruby Room, man. Wax is the camera. This place is tight as shit. Pictures paintings of naked chicks. So if you masturbate to these paintings, you imagine that you're a painting. guy slept last night. He's chilling right here. On the side of the shit. The reason the, the hood is popped is because I guess we left some type of shit on in the car last night. And uh I guess we left some shit on. And the fucking in the morning the battery was dead. So we didn't realize it last night because there was a truck parked where I'm standing. We parked right in front of a fucking police station. So this lady cop came out this morning and helped us out, jumped our fucking car. We don't have cables with us. Our interior lights don't work at night. It's not very safe. But uh, yeah, that's about all I got for you right now. Peace to Mo uh, KG from Mobius. Sorry we dipped out on you last night. Uh, we just we were gonna go get a pack of cigarettes or whatever, and then we we're just like, man, let's get the fuck out of here. And we, were at, we were at this party last night, and it was like a shitload of people over there rolling, doing ecstasy and, ecstasy and shit. White people trying to beatbox when they don't have any rhythm. Shit like that, but uh, it was a good time, man. We had a great time last night. All the people that came out, man, Don and his crew with Haji buying us beer. Shout out to them. Shout out to my boy Rob that came out, his boy Christopher Michael Jones that came out. Oh man, Jake, his girl. Uh, I don't know, there was a bunch of people there, man. A bunch of loyal Wax Herbal Tea fans, man. We had a great ass time in Phoenix, man. This is Matt walking up from taking a shit. Uh, get it? Take a shit. It's funny because it's take a shit. I'm gonna fuck with him a little bit. <laughs> hey Matt, is there anything that annoys you? If so, what are some of those things that do annoy you? Large, hipped women cops. I thought you was. I thought you said earlier you wanted to fuck her. I said they annoy me. Oh. Yeah. 
and has nothing to do with wanting to fuck Matt, you. Matt hates helpful cops that help jumpstart our car that he said he would fuck. Yeah. Apparently he hates them now. Yeah, they fucking pissed He's just off. trying to be tough on camera on some like, fuck the police shit. Have you looked at me? There's nothing tough about this. Look how white those shoes are. This motherfucker looks like Jordan.